everybody. So today we're back here again with Luke and he brought his SC300 and uh, I'm pretty excited for this. He ended up buying my old wheels off my 240SX and uh, I can't wait to see how these are gonna work on this car. So here's his old wheels that he has. You can see they're just kind of, the, the, front, the front ones honestly, I don't mind the look they're okay. of. They're just, they don't really fit the wheel wells as quite as nice and these back ones here, I don't know, they're, Dated. I don't like those at all. And they're such sunken battleships, dude. They're just <laughs> battleships. They are. Yeah. So we'll go ahead. We'll get our. Uh, I'll, get, get I'll get the wheels and we'll put tires on them, and then we'll bring them in here and put them on. So yeah, I just can't wait to see how this thing looks. Quick update. Yep. saw the wheels we just brought them in they're actually off of a Nissan 350z um, like I said they used to be on my 240sx which I think they're gonna look really good on the Lexus I think you'll, oh, they're gonna be hot. we can't I'm gonna put these on see how look. but the uh, I think these are these are the fronts right yep. so these are 17 by seven and a half in the front, the front and the then rear. the two rears are 17 by eight in the rear so it's got a staggered setup uh, the tires are 225 45 17 and 235 Forty-five, seventeen. They're I don't know. They're not like a performance tire by any mean. It's just no. They're just all seasons. Yeah, just something just to get yeah. around. I We're just trying, <laughs> trying to get try, trying to get this thing yeah. nice and drivable because the front right was all bubbled. Yeah, and these I mean, just it'll be nice just having matched wheels and stuff. This tire over here started getting a bubble in it, which it looks pretty flat right now. So we'll get rid of these old wheels, put the new ones on, and yeah, it's gonna be dope. I can't wait to put these on here. So you guys have it, we got the wheels all installed. I think they turned out 
awesome. They look 100% better than those mismatched wheels. Um, it's actually later on in the day, as you can see, we've yeah, kind of we changed. changed a little bit. Um, <laughs> forgot to do the outro, so we're going to do that now. Um, I don't know. I think it looks awesome. What do you think? I'm with it. I think they turned out it. really good. I, I like how they fit. I mean, you got like it's pretty flush there with the fender. For these being 17 by seven and a half, I think. Yep, so, in the front. Yeah, so those are nice. The rears fit pretty well too. I think they could use just a little bit of a spacer just to Maybe help flush. hold out just a little bit more. And uh, this thing needs coilovers, dude. I know it does. We it need needs a lot of stuff. It needs to get some coilovers on this. But yeah, I definitely like the way these turned out. I know you and I were talking about possibly dipping these wheels. Yeah, we were thinking of a color. We're not sure, though. So if you guys have any ideas... Yeah, throw it down in the comments. Put in the comments. Um, I'm sure you're going to post this on Instagram. Oh, yeah, this will be on Instagram. So go check out his Instagram, like his newest post, and uh, throw, it down, throw it in his comments as well. Oh, yeah. As far as colors and whether you guys like it, not, like it or not. So I think we're going to end it here. I know he's got a lot more stuff planned for this car, so yep. make sure to subscribe for that. And... Uh, we also have a ton of other builds going on on the channel as well. I got a ton of more stuff coming for the Civic. And we still need to start the Explorer build. So stay tuned for that. But otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next one.